So this time around, we're going to go out sailing and then we're going to test out AIS and figure out how all that works. I'm going to teach my crew how AIS works. Next week, we're going to Catalina. So I'm going to go test that out and I'm going to show you where the AIS unit is. Okay, we're off to an adventure. Here we go. Walk it down. Three hour tour. <laughs> Come on, go ahead. Trying to get some gas or diesel Maybe we wait here. and uh, so I'm just gonna wait for space to get in there okay where's this guy, guy gonna go Behind this guy. <laughs> we found a free spot right there. Can you raise the spinnaker halyard just a tad? Well, what do you think about this day? Okay, wind is coming from the north. So that usually that means more wind. So I don't even need to look at the forecast. I just look at the flag. Flag tells me it's coming from there. And, no, the flag right there. We'll probably head offshore. We'll see how far we get. So far, the wind is still pretty moderate. It's only uh, nine knots. So, pretty mild. Making sure I don't, I don't hit this guy here. Okay, heading up. Hey, what mark is that? Five point nine knots with winds of eight point eight point zero. It's not very windy right now. So light air, night, lots of boats, but we stayed away from, we're fairly far away. Look at that, sailboat, no motor. We're going so fast and we don't have any kind of motor. It's amazing. I'm not using any fuel. Nothing. No one's driving a boat. For who? For me. When was that? Uh, I would have been. That was a couple of weeks ago. Yeah. <laughs> Are you getting? Looking at my smart solar here, and you can see I'm getting 100, 116, 100, all the way to 120 watts of charge. And I'm actually, oops, I'm actually an absorption here. So you see that? It says absorption. So that means the battery is pretty close to full. So pretty neat. So I don't run out of power even though I'm not, I'm using a lot of power with all these, all these instruments here and all that. The electric witches and the refrigerator and all that. And not a big deal because we got solar happening right now okay i'm keeping an eye on that boat no it's me i'm going down on him yeah i haven't been to it but i've seen pictures of red about i i saw the when it okay yeah he's trying he's just like he's purposely trying to take me up and then he can't because he's heading too high. He's heading too high and he's slowing down. Yeah. So he's like. Uh, so 19. Um... Okay, guys, get ready to attack, though. Okay. 
We we're, uh, we don't have to do much of anything, but uh, we're gonna go back. We're gonna go back. Okay, let's go. Ready? Actually, we have to furl it. We have to furl it. Okay, it's furled. Okay. You know what that originally was? No. William Randall. Go ahead. You can't do that by hand. I don't think. Wow. The guest house is still there. Yeah. She put that thing there. That was uh, William Miranda's house. Well, anyway, so here we are on AIS, and then I'm checking some of these out, right, to see what these votes are, right? Right. Sojourner. Yeah. Anyway. That's right in front of us. Headed right at us. I can see him. Is it? Okay. I read the whole thing. He's on the power, let's <laughs> So anyway, so what I noticed was that when we're in a collision course, yeah. they start flashing red. Do they? Yeah. Nice. Oh, really? We're, I mean, what's it say about this guy coming right on us? You know, I think I used he's to be flashing, or is he just? Yeah, I mean, it's not far. really on a collision course. No, but we're he's, just gonna he's cross going in the same direction we are. Okay. Oh yeah, then he's not on a collision course. Oh, yeah, I guess so. He was yeah. following yeah. us. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. And he was on That's a. That's really cool. So all we have to do is look at the the chart. I don't even have any audible signals. We just take a glance and see if anything see if is on collision course. If it comes up red, then we need to watch. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Oh, obviously, if it's nighttime and you're sleeping, you need to set the alarm. Yeah. Can you adjust the range? Yeah. Oh yeah. I mean, these, uh, so that takes and so guy, that uh, gives you traffic. The problem with the big ships when you're out in the traffic lane, the what do you call that lane? The shipping, the shipping, shipping lane, right? So when you're in the shipping lane, the problem with looking at small boats versus a big boat is those guys are going 40 knots. <laughs> so they look very far away. One minute later, <laughs> they're running you down. And like the last time we did that, we were like. Uh, we were like, what, uh, 100 yards away? So, this is the way we're going to do it now. This is best for big ships. For small boats, obviously, you can just you can just avoid them. Yeah. The big ship, you can't do a visual. you got to track them. So that keeps it easy. That's kind of nice. Very cool. Very cool. The is really nice. And it, well, it's kind of backwards, not like your phone, but you know, it's good enough. Oh, you can even do a fish finder if I had one. Really? Right. But I did not install a, there's no fish finder on this. But you could. Look at all the AIS signals coming out of a marina. Yeah, look at that. Ride with a Code Zero, isn't it? Oh, yeah. I mean, it's like, uh, and it's like no, none of the work when you have spinnaker. Spinnaker so much work. Our code zero. Yeah, not much work. Except you know, code zero is not colorful like our spinnaker used to be. Spinnaker is more colorful. Maybe we can get a sponsor. But you know what? If I go racing, I gotta put tail numbers in those tails. Yeah, yeah. My uncle had a whole power boat. I, the power boat to collision course. At 115, I couldn't stop. That's yeah. A long way away. So Actually, there's a there's a second power boat right there. It's not that long. Maybe a thousand yards. Okay. I imagine he was good. It took me a long time to stop. Yeah. So I don't know where he was. Yeah. That. Uh, where is it? Is that the power boat that's on the side? It's on the. Well, there's two in there. I'm confused. There's two in there. Yeah, so one. There's two in there. Well, you can check the name. Pop, tap on it. The Blue Northern. Find out who sailing, it is we're going to get. Sailing vessel. Oh, it's a sailing vessel. So there's so many. Oh, that one. Gotta the be blue right one. Here. The gotta blue be. one yeah. is yeah. pointed at us. Okay. Which oh, makes yeah. sense. They're pointed at us. Yeah, he's not pointed. Blow it up and see 
and right uh, here. Look at the what is that perimeter? That's that perimeter. Oh, yeah. it, it's the yes. it's a circle of pre-assigned uh, pre uh, pre uh, yeah. closest yeah. point of approach. So that's this guy right Yeah, here. that's that that boat right there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh wait a minute! Look at that. Oh he didn't register there. He doesn't have AIS. Yeah. Yeah. So if we hit him, it doesn't count? <laughs> well, that's, that doesn't seem no fair. Point. No points. That's not right. You get no points if you don't have AIS. Now, this guy is actually pointed towards him. Yeah, so that, and his AIS is uh, telling us that for sure. So that's good. There, that's AIS. Which is kind of cool, and it has radar too. It's actually a big boat. What is that? Fifty? Yeah. Yeah. No, no. You see, so, so many boats now have AIS, right? Which is kind of cool. Next thing, what's going to happen is that Zuckerberg is going to track all these boats. He's going to track. It's going to find a way. I notice he's been sailing in water. People often ask about what's the product here. Yeah. What are you shopping for? He, he look for a way to track anything. The air we breathe. Which one is it? Uh, this one or the one behind it? Uh, we won't know that. Until we hit it. <laughs> We're definitely in collision course with this one. That one is a collision course, yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. yeah. There's nobody on a collision course with us. No, that guy is on collision course in a few in a minute. And I'm talking a minute. He evaded. He he had it down. We're gonna get close though. That's part of the excitement. Get close. Boats, it may have AIS, so that that one there. This one did not have AIS. This fall. So that one is on collision course. It's actually sink. So. And uh, well, it's within the range of uh, whatever you define. It's predefined. You define it in the, in Raymarine. That's the one that was the other collision course. How come both boats are blue? Blue boats have AIS. Yeah, so there's the new conclusion, guys. Blue boats have AIS. At least if they're sailboats. They ought to have AIS. The pirate ship. That really looks high made. It's set up to do to do an alarm. <laughs> Very it's a, it's a thing with so much traffic in the marina. There's so much traffic in here. This AI is like, it's like beeping every you know. Yeah, it's like a Christmas tree. That's uh Seven point one knots. Speaking yeah, of which, you got that bad. guy coming up uh, yeah. on the nose. Where? Where? What? Oh, about eleven o'clock, right there. Okay. Power boat. Maybe three hundred yards. The power boat, but he doesn't have AIS. Oh, no, he doesn't. <laughs> well, this. He's a failure. He doesn't have AIS. Oh, there it is. This guy is it's flashing. I don't care what he's got. He's got <laughs> something <laughs> flashing at the collision. This guy already hit us. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is the guy, this this guy, the collision one? He already hit us. Oh, okay. Just because of him. Picking up the pieces, looking for survivors. You know, fancy boat, can't afford AIS. Sucks. I mean, if you can afford that kind of boat, you can afford AIS. He hasn't turned off. How would he sneak up on the other one? Okay, we're gonna we're gonna have to take that. We're gonna have to take down the or furl the code zero.
Before we turn? Yeah, before we turn. Okay. Okay, so when I make a turn over there, you're going to turn that in because we're going to go uh, upwind. Okay, so as I turn, you start turning it in. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah. I'm going to try to hug the port side. Well, I want to give you the maximum smell of the. Uh, what is that? The old Del Mar? Don't want to fall down here. We're flying the code there inside the harbor. It's kind of hard to. Yeah. Because we're DDW, so it's very hard. It's not really a DDW sale. Hey, you see this boat that's just packed? Yeah. Oh, Sojourner. Sojourner, is that how you pronounce that? Where? Okay, where are we? Now, you know exactly what to do. This is actually so simple, we can fly, we can fly the Code Zero right inside the channel. That's usually something you wouldn't normally do, but here it's easy. A lot of history down there. Well, I I didn't uh, I didn't jinx it. You didn't hit anything. <laughs> no jinx. So here's my radio, and this one has AIS on it. So let me turn it on, and there it goes. And uh, actually, I'll show you where the actual unit is. Okay, then I have to open up this compartment here, and where is the AIS? So it's not here, so it's probably over here. Oh, I know where it is. It's in here. Ah, there it is. So, there's the Raymarine Brain, I believe. The AIS. Nope, that's not it, so it must be over here. There you go. That's where the AIS unit is. You can see the antennas. So that's the one that actually powers this. Anyway, that's how AIS works. And hopefully next week, we'll actually be able to test it live as we go to Catalina Island. It's a 40 nautical mile journey, so we're gonna try that. Thanks a lot, see you later.